Just walking into the door of Black Store and Hot Bottom is like a step into the past. Inside, you find the groceries we know so well today, in a setting that was common a century ago. There's a penny candy selection, although inflation now has them at two cents each. And in here, you also find conversation, familiar faces, a family that has owned the place for 56 years. I raised three kids in this store. We met three generations of the family that keeps this longtime tradition alive. Barbara Corey, her daughter Sarah, and granddaughter Molly. There's pictures of birthdays celebrated here. We had cake with our grandparents. Um, when we had prom or anything like that, we always came here, all of us grandkids. This was the place to come. Even the youngest generation has an appreciation for the history. One thing I like about it, though, is it has all the old stuff all around the top. Yes, the store is lined with pieces of the past. It was stolen once, and so a hunter found yeah. it. Including the old register front and center. But the owners also know the challenges of running a small business in the present. Because we were going to close on December 31st of last year, because last year was so bad. But everybody kept saying to me, you can't, you can't, you can't. Hot Bottom is about 20 minutes or more away from the nearest supermarket. So for years, having a store like this was a big convenience. But now, many people just pass by. We put so much into this place. This is to try to keep the doors open, to try to draw people in, to try to come up with something new. But I would be lost if I couldn't come here every day. So they work hard to keep prices similar to what you find at the big stores and remind their neighbors, Black Store offers more than just groceries. Instead of going to Nicholson, come buy a gallon of milk here and say hi because we're always gonna talk to you and always be friendly. And do what they can to preserve this longtime tradition. John Meyer, Newswatch 16, on the Pennsylvania Road in Susquehanna County.